Gilad Atzmon is one of jazz's most inventive and controversial artists. With 10 albums to his name, including the award-winning Exile in 2004, he is again breaking new ground with the October release of My Refuge on Enya Records. His recent sold-out performance at Pizza Express in London saw him previewing the new album, and in a candid and in-depth interview for Newsflash TV, Gilad discussed his career to date, his musical ambitions, and his political views. I used to think that we have our music in our disposal and we just put the tune that we like to play or whatever. And I understand that actually we, it's the other way around, we belong to music as much as we belong to language. It is there. We are just visitors. So tonight you're going to be my visitor. I started to play very late. Uh, I was 17 or something like that. Um, I had my first saxophone. It is an, a very easy instrument to pick up, you know. I had a very good teacher. I probably had four or five lessons. But he was a very good teacher. I still walk, try to work out <laughs> what he was talking about. Um, was a Russian saxophonist. His name was is still Boris Gammer. Um, and and then I happened to hear Charlie Parker and Campbell Adderley. Later at Coltrane, and it made me feel very small, <laughs> which was a crucial part of my development. I have uh, an acoustic vision, sonic vision, melodic vision. I would write a tune. For instance, the album that we are gonna, going to launch in September, October, is kind of sound that I had in my mind, but it took us a long time to to know how to produce this sound with electronics. I'm still investigating. I start to understand now what I really want, what, will, what may achieve the sound that I'm looking for. But yes, I'm coming with the melodies, with the harmony. And uh, while in my early days, I would tell the drummer, I want you to do that, you know, because we had an image of musician that knows everything. No, <laughs> I'm playing with the best drummer on this planet, you know? I'm not going to tell him what to play on the drums. This is what he's doing, you know? He's, he knows exactly what to play. And if he doesn't, if he wouldn't know how to play, so I may have to take the second best drummer or the third. Mm -hmm. 